How's it going guys? It's Tyler and today I'm going to be showing you how to reset an Apple Watch back to factory settings um, if it has a pin code or if it's stuck in the setup. Uh, so as you can see this Apple Watch has a pin code on it that we do not know what it is. So today I'm going to show you how to quickly reset it back to factory settings. Just a quick note, if the Apple Watch is paired to an iPhone that has an iCloud account on it, um, the watch will be activation locked. So you will need to remove the watch from the Find My um, app or the iCloud settings before you do this or the watch will be activation locked. Um, so the first thing you're going to need is the charger for the Apple Watch. As you can see, we have a charging symbol up here that you know references that it is charging. And then what you're going to do is you're going to press and hold the sleep button on the side until we get this uh, SOS screen here. Okay, this is called the power off screen. And from here, you're just going to press and hold the crown button in. And then it's going to ask you, do you want to erase all content and settings? We're going to hit reset and reset again. And then set the watch down and wait patiently and it will be reset once this goes around one full circle. All right, so now that our watch is done resetting, we can easily go through the setup and set it up to our liking. Um, if this Apple Watch is activation locked at all, uh, once you get so far into the setup here and you actually pair it to an iPhone, it'll let you know if it's linked to an account or not. Um, like I said, you need to make sure that you remove it from the previous iPhone uh, from the Find My app or the iCloud account linked um, with the watch. But other than that, that's how you reset an Apple Watch to its factory settings. If you can't remember the pin code or if it's ever stuck in the setup, um, you can still reset it even from this point. Have a good day.